Hartso might be better than uh, Grafton. Only a little bit, though. Really, yeah, it's Eastweld, Northweld, Iron Oaks, and the Royces that are the good ones. Let's see if we can get a girl from one of these to marry. It could be worth it. If they don't have another kid. And we also get Haystack Hall. She's 29. So we won't get Haystack. Yeah, we could actually. Hmm. Yeah, he's definitely going to inherit. Um, if... Yeah. The Rainwood one actually looks better then. If you ask me. Okay, yeah, so it's either Iron Oaks or Gull Town. Now, if he dies, he gets it. She gets it. She's younger. They're 23. This one, it goes to him, definitely. She's 29. She's older. She's a, uh, depressed and he's a drunkard. And this one's five years old. Okay, let's go for this one. There we go. Perfect. Ed gets the marry of Wainwood, which is a quite a good marriage of him. The Wainwoods tend to marry like Aaron's and stuff. And Royce's. They didn't want really to get very good marriages. So that's a good marriage for us. Let's click back on this. 79%. Okay, let's see if we can get this then. 11%. Send gift. That's 11. So that would be 90. Just need 10%. Okay. And just one more for good luck. 9%. The highest one. 10%. There we go. Perfect. Because we've been found, we've been discovered. We have to go all in of trying to get these guys. Peasant, wh wh where is a uh, what? Where did they all go? Did they all those sons of? I paid them money, and they've all then just thrown it back at me and said, "Actually, we don't want to join you." You sons of! What the hell just happened? Five percent, nine percent. 6%. I've spent all my money again and we can't even get there probably. Uh, use as you see fit. Might be corrupt. Use as you see fit. Okay. Decided not to risk upsetting his vassals and confess to the alley. Yay! He gave us the bribe of one gold. Thank you so much. The grand feast in the Eyrie. We'll come to the feast. So I'm going to be in the Eyrie. There we go. It's done. I still can't take cold water because they'll just take it back. Instead of venison and boar and all kinds of cheese, I had thought Lord Ron would serve at his feast. We were served courses that could have been served at dinner at a much poorer man's house. Hmm. Lustful, selfish, diligent, stubborn. Um, I'm good Gary, so I understand what you should do in a particular situation. Shame on you. Reflect your temperance. Well done. Yeah, I'll say that. Because I'm playing the social game. My guy knows how to do that. Ah, excellent. So, yeah. So, we've gotten Yon Royce to like me, which is exactly what I want. I want him to make me a regent. Make me your regent. He banished the peasants. 69%. So what happened to the Belmores then? The war seems to be over. Strong Song. He's just been put into jail. His wife is dead. Isn't that lovely? His son's in jail. The one married to the Royce girl. The Tawny of Redfort. Yes. You had a bastard son, it seems. Yep. Ah, oh, wait, 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 wait. So, it looks like we're Bran Stark. So, it looks as though Rickard died at... Oh, what the... Rickard has a drag... What the hell is going on in this scenario? We are having... This, this is... We're having the weirdest stuff happen. What the hell? Rickard got a dragon egg. How is this even possible? Then he died of an illness. So, the Lord Paramount Brandon... You know, skilled fighter, strong. He has ice. He's got a dragon egg now. This is insane. Oh my god. 
Have you seen this, Eddard? Have you seen what's been going on with your brother? Benjon is now the High Lord of Skagos. Okay, and their sister's the Queen. This is insane. The Targaryens, how can you allow this? He, want, he wants a, a dragon egg, apparently, as well. That's crazy. Ariana's come of age, she married a Corgill. Matrilini, of course. Ready our horse. Okay, again, he's changed it. We're up against Donald Rainwood. He's a pretty good skilled fighter. Steady the horse. And we've been hit. Okay, man, just stay on my horse. We'll get him this time. Oh, we missed again. And we've been hit off. Not really surprised. Wainwood was pretty good. Okay, pray for guidance. Well, I am zealous, after all. Pray for guidance. Edison Tollett and Samwell. Ed beat Samwell. Excellent. Yes, Ed won the tourney of Redfort. He beat Wainwood for us. You know what? I want to make you regent, but I can't. My wife is, isn't she? Yeah. Ah, my little Osney Stone. Go, Ed. Ed is just amazing. He's over. Look at that terrible beard. I mean, moustache. Look at that terrible moustache. What an idiot. What a fool. 69. How come you didn't automatically invite him? Yes. Go. I don't know what's going on with this. Sometimes. sometimes it doesn't work properly. What the? Yeah, invite the plot. You guys should be automatically invited. What the hell's going on? Those are the guys I paid, I think, if I remember correctly. There we go. There we go. We've got it up. Osney's slow to learn the talk. Well, I'm diligent, so uh, show him by example. He's become trusting. My daughter's pregnant again. Good job. The tawny of Hard Vale. This is below us. We want bigger tawnies, bigger prizes. No, John Aaron's had many kids. No, this is even more important than to kill his family. Damn it. We need the Aaron to get a claim. I don't think you'll get a claim in this situation. Damn it. Winter's coming to an end though, so that's good. Damn it, he's had loads of kids. They had twins, that was why. Damn it. I'm going to have to kill both the sons off. Oh no! John... John died. John died of old age, a natural death. The Grell girl is now widowed. The new Paramount, Lord Paramount Humphrey. His regent is a Doniger. Now, we've gone up to be able to kill him. Yeah, he has no claim. We're going to have to kill them off. Terence, Elena, Anya. Yep, we're going to have to kill them all off. Let's cause chaos in the Vale. I'll be known as the... The killer of Aaron's. My wife died. That is a shame. I guess I could marry <laughs> I could marry someone interesting and we have no son so if I have a son they could become the next lord and I want the Tully girls <gasps> cat no she died when she was pregnant she's married to a flint as well okay Elisa she had all daughters with Jamie wow okay what happened to Jamie in the end he's just you know in Cassidy Rock. Great fighter, but not a good marshal at all. Tyrion's a much better war leader. He's just got too many children. Oh, he got married again. She died of grayscale, Cersei. Wow. So, yeah. Okay, wow. But, yeah, so let, let, let's look at me then. So, who could. I could marry the Grafton girl, I guess. Yep, yeah, I guess we'll probably just do that. That makes complete sense. We'll try that one out, I guess. 
or the sister. He probably hates me, though. Why can't I marry? Oh, am I widowed? Huh. No widow? <laughs> okay. Huh. I'm surprised that I can't marry them. I don't know why. Okay, we'll wait and see. Intrigue, 139. We have a chance to kill the Paramount. Bioma Tollet. You know what? I like the fact that my daughter is doing a good job. Yeah, if I die and become her, that'd be quite good. Belmore has been released. Okay, Grafton. I will marry you. Hopefully they let this happen. What? Why can't I marry? What's wrong with me? Is there something wrong with me? Do I have an illness? I don't understand. I can marry everyone else, but I cannot marry... What the... What is going on with this? Let's just check one more time. Make sure I'm just not going crazy. Okay, apparently not. Arrange marriage? No, I just can't click me. What the hell's going on? Huh. We'll have to wait and see then. But yeah, my heir, she's got two good kids now. Descendants of Aaron's. I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna pay attention to what uh, Rhaegar is doing. Cause he just constantly just keeps changing the law. See, look, he just goes back and forth. He can't decide. Estamont died. Only has a daughter still. Still not pregnant either. Again, she's a trusting lunatic. Well, that's always that's always a great mix. If we can get rid of him, he's 12 years old. If we can just kill him, the other son's only one years old, so we have lots of time to kill him. If we can kill that one, then our daughter's husband should get a claim. Group of craftsmen. Hmm. Okay, let's try the investment. Yeah, might as well. If he gets me more money, I am greedy. He's still alive. Jesus, Jan. We need to wait till he dies. Hosta Tully is now known as the Pompous. The Pompous Hosta Tully. How are you and your kids? You have spent some time in Strong, so I feel that you have found a promising candidate for membership in potential factions supported by your liege. A small amount of persuasion. Huh. What? Which one is this? My liege will be informed. Okay, apparently he sent me there to go do that. I'm the spy master of Runestone. Really? I did not even think about that. Huh. We could probably kill him very easily. But yeah, that won't help me anyway. There's really no need to do any of that. You can trust me, Jan. We're good friends. <laughs> Just so I can use him. 146%. Come on. Come on. You went off a bit ago. You completely failed. But it went off. Plot to kill Power Mount has leaked out. Damn it. Do you lead of a plot to kill him? Bastard. Yeah, I'm going to have to pay him. 100 gold. Dragons. Dragon Egg. Yeah, Brandon is the only person in the world with a Dragon Egg. Can't believe that. I don't think I ever see the AI find a dragon egg. That is crazy. It'd be cool if you could hatch it. Aethon Stark is the next heir. So things have been pretty peaceful, actually. Since Rhaegar's taken over, things have been very peaceful in the lands. Um, I'm Gregarious. I want to meet people. So, yeah, make welcome of a lavish feast. We'll say reluctantly because I'm greedy and selfish. Oh, sorry, selfish, not greedy. I want to keep all the money to myself. So we'll bring them in. It's proper, but we won't spend too much. Um, let them leave quietly. Excellent news. 
More gold for me. <laughs> oh, he just had twins. A quick son, Prince Ares, and uh, just a normal twin. Okay, well, okay, there we go. Apparently we've become stressed. After all these plots and stuff and the problems that we've had in our family, I've become a bit stressed. Luckily we have good old Ed with us. He keeps us firmly on the ground. Excellent. The voices love me. I befriended him. I give me everything. Get married. I shouldn't have clipped that, actually. Oh, wow. Okay. Looks like he inherited it. I still could not get it. And they would not accept anyway, probably. Okay, we'll just marry anyone then. Let's just marry a Tully, probably. A Yarwick. Hmm. Maybe someone in the Reach. Uh, sorry, the uh, the Veil. I can't see anyone we could marry in the Veil at all. No. These are terrible. Now, I'm going to keep it like that. I want to become my daughter because then um, she's pregnant. Excellent. Because then if we can get him on to be the Lord Paramount, we'll then become those kids. So we'll control the Veil. So I, I probably want to keep that. Educate my son. Groom for command. He may be a bastard, but he's my bastard. And they've had another son, Ronald Tollett. Jesus. Ah. A tournament. The Pompous. Gerald the Pompous. Um, well, we'll go. We'll go. Might as well. You're right next to us. Rhaegar is now depressed. Not sure why he's depressed. The Lion. Tywin the Lion. Ready our horse. We're up against Humphrey Stone. Steady. He'll probably win. Oh, we've managed to hit him. And we've managed to knock him off. Wow. Very good. We're now up against Valar Darkholm. Oh, wow. He's a pretty good one. None can beat me. But we've been hit. And we've been beaten. And Lord Paramount Tywin died of grayscale. Just like that. He's gone at 52 years old. And his son, Jamie Lannister. And Lisa. Lisa Tully. Uh, and he has two little girls. Tysha Lannister. And they've all got Drown God. It just seems to be a thing. Always the Lannisters constantly keep getting that Drown God thing. I need to try and fix that. Oh, Tyrion got married to a crack hall. Okay, uh... Emond won the next one. Oh, he's a genius. After many tilts, Ed won the tournament. Good job. A regional tourney and a small tourney win. Good job, Ed. You are just you, you're just amazing. I love you. You're just oh, I can't get over how much I like the character <laughs> and how well he's done. 140%. Come on. He's just gotten married. We need to stop this. He married a Stark, uh, one of the sisters to Brandon. We have to kill him before he has a baby. We have to. The, top, the Grand Tawny of High Garden. Ooh. Well, of course. Whoa, look at all those daughters. Willis. Uh, and Willis had a son. He married Mega Baratheon. Okay. It looks like a lot of the families have quite a lot of kids. Ariane has not had kids yet, but she has some brothers. Okay, Tawny gets underway. Maybe Ed will be in this one. Maybe he can do it. I think he can. Okay, my bastard. We're going to make you a good fighter. So we could go for Ed. I'm going to go for the King's Guard again. Let's look at the King's Guard. Who's in the King's Guard now? The Lord Commander, Brendel. So he's a lowborn and he's a craven with trained... What the... Why is this guy the Lord... Why is he even on the King's Guard at all? Uh, Valar Hill, uh, a bastard Sarwick. He's quick. Now this guy's a good one. Hmm. He's actually quite a good one. Uh, Barristan the Bold is still there. Albert Shett. Uh... Davin Lannister. A Lannister's been put on there. Skilled fighter. Okay. Malkin Branfield. Ooh, Branfield. 
Huh. Okay. Skilled fighter. And, uh... Simon Manning. 